finally i got the chance to eat at my favorite restaurant after lockdown i am very happy you know i ate my all time loved mushroom pasta and i drank a whole glass of chocolate milkshake because i was very thirsty do you know there are words that you can use to describe the same sentence but in a much better way hi guys i am vani from ingwarta and i welcome you all once again There is nothing wrong with the sentence that I made earlier. But using very each and every time in front of words like happy, good, bad, sad, it is just outdated. And don't you want to learn some new words that you can use to describe the same feeling but in an enhanced manner? Don't you want to be more expressive next time? So let's gear up and let's get started. Word number 1. Instead of saying very happy, replace it with delightful or cheerful. For example, after eating the burger that I had been craving for so long, I felt very happy. Or you could say, after eating the burger that I had been craving for so long, I felt delightful. Word number 2. replace very sad with sorrowful or dejected for example rahul had worked really hard on the presentation but after scoring low grades he felt very sad or you could say rahul had worked really hard on the presentation but after scoring low grades he felt beyond dejected now can you notice the difference between the two sentences they basically mean the same and the only word that i have changed is very sad and i have replaced it with beyond dejected the second sentence sounds much more advanced as compared to the first one but there isn't much difference let's move on to word number 3 stop saying very bad use terrible or awful instead for example I feel very bad for forgetting her birthday or I feel awful for forgetting her birthday which sentence sounds enhanced as compared to the other one you tell me now good is a very commonly used word and very good can be easily replaced with brilliant or superb that's a word number 4 you can easily say The Netflix series is brilliant. It's a must watch. Or the Netflix series is superb. It's a must watch. Word number 5. Don't say very thirsty. Use dehydrated or parched instead. For example, I was dehydrated, so I drank a lot of water. Word number 6. Don't go with very beautiful to compliment every time. You can easily use gorgeous or stunning. For example, Rina wore a gorgeous pink dress to the wedding. So these are just some words. There are many 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 more words like these. Today I've told you 6 of them. Now your assignment is that you would tell me that what will you use instead of saying very excited? and write it in the comments below and as i always say if you have any questions or suggestions regarding our future videos do comment in the comments below till then don't settle down with very every time be more expressive happy learning ingvarta your english practice playground no judgment only motivation and constructive feedback Join today